Help Docs and Teamwork Desk are a great way for your team to provide vital support information for your customers on how to get the most out of your products. A clear system of helpful documentation can greatly reduce the need for customers to create more trivial tickets, freeing your agents up to deal with the more immediate issues. To create a Help Docs site, all we need to do is select the Help Docs option on the top. And here you can see that I've created two different Help Docs sites. So we can see the name of the site, for instance, getting to know our product. We can see the number of articles and how many of these articles are published versus drafts. And if we want to create an entirely new Help Docs site, all we need to do is select Add a Site. In this Add a New Help Docs Site window, the first thing we need to do is give our site a name. Below this, we can add a subdomain for our site. And if we want to add a site headline, we can easily do so here. Once we're happy, just select add a site. And there you go, we've successfully created our help doc site. Now we can go about creating articles, updating the appearance, the settings. But for now, let's have a look at adding our first article. When adding our article, we can easily update our article title. And below this, we can add the body of our article. As you can see here, we have several formatting and embedding options. Down here, we can add the article itself. Now here you can see that I've added some text and I've embedded an image to our article. Over on the right hand side, we can update the status of this article. So this can be a draft, it can be published or indeed unpublished. If we've added any categories, we can easily choose one here or indeed we can add a new category. When adding a category, we just need to add the category name. We can state where we want to nest this category. So it can be top level or if we have other categories, we can make it a subcategory of that category. We can toggle on or off whether or not to show this on the home page. We can customize our slug. Or if this category is replacing an older category, we can add that old URL here to create a redirect. Then just select add category. Now we can easily choose this category here. In more options, we can customize the slug. So that's the end of the URL for this article. We can set the display order or relevance here. If we've enabled comments at a site level, we can then enable them here. And again, we can also add an old URL for the article. We can choose our text editor type so it can be HTML or Markdown. And if we want to delete the article, we can easily do so here. Looking back up to the top now, and if we select the related articles option, then we can easily select any articles which will be related to our current article. Likewise, we can add keywords. And these keywords will help when a user is searching for something related to this article. All we have to do is select our keyword or phrase, then just select add. And of course, we can add more phrases here. If we ever need to go back to an older version of a particular article, we can easily do so in the revisions tab here. However, since we're creating this article for the first time, we don't currently have any revisions. And that's it. That's how easy it is to set up help docs in Teamwork Desk. If you have any further questions, feel free to contact us, support at teamwork.com.